Many math people knows how to solve quadratic congruence equation when modulo is prime. But how about modulo is not prime? Is there a algorithm to get solutions? I want to show you breaking down x square is congruent to x modulo m into linear congruent equation. And apply it to x square is congruent to u square modulo m, and solve it. First of all, let's solve x square is congruent to x modulo m. We will call it as our equation. m is composition number. We can divide this congruence equation by x, then modulo will change. This is characteristic of congruence equation. Then we can substitute x like this. Let's take a look some linear congruence equation like this. This equation has solution only if this equation satisfies. It means b is divisible by d. So, our equation has solution only if this equation satisfies. It means, this two numbers are ka prime. So, we can remove gcd term away. For example, if m has form of this. Our equation will be two linear congruence equations. Remember there are trivial solutions, 0 and 1. More clear example, if m is 15. Then our equation will be two linear congruence equations like these, and we can solve it more easily. Then, solutions will 0, 1, 6, 10. Let's solve another equation. It is x square is congruent to u square modulo m, and u is natural number. We will call it as u equation. Start from our equation. From now, we will call solution of our equation as r. Manipulate our equation like this, then solution of u equation will be 2ur minus u. Now, go back to first equation, 5x square minus 8x plus 12 congruent to 0 modulo 48. Manipulate the equation like this. And take 10x minus 8 congruent to 4 square. This is u equation, so y will 8r minus 4. Let's get r from our equation modulo 48. Remember, there's trivial solution, 0 and 1. So, we can get y from our equation. We can get x by solving linear congruence equations. Finally, we could get solutions of quadratic congruence equation when modulo is not prime, using our equation and u equation. Thanks for watching.